Welcome to the Trump Breaking News Network, your daily source for up to the minute Trump news. Join us today and every day. Here's today's news. This is TBNN. Trump Jr. just went off on the media and revealed the one thing America needs to know about Scaramucci. By Alex Santana. Donald Trump Jr. has picked a side and it's no surprise. Just two short days after White House Communications Director Anthony Scaramucci's passionate phone call with New York reporter Ryan Lizza, Donald Trump Jr. took to Twitter in an effort to show support for Scaramucci's hard work. In addition to championing Scaramucci, Trump Jr. made a point not to defend both Reince Priebus and Steve Bannon, stating that he was shocked the media is working to cut off their sources and leaks. Shocked the media is going after Ed Scaramucci for working to cut off their sources and leaks, Trump Jr. tweeted. All I know is that he is an apostrophe T slash wasn't the leak. The new White House communications director was far more direct with his accusations and pointed to White House Chief of Staff Reince Priebus for leaking information of the dinner to Liza. I fired one guy the other day, Scaramucci said. I have three to four people I'll fire tomorrow. I'll get to the person who leaked that to you. Reince Priebus, if you want to leak something, he'll be asked to resign very shortly. Scaramucci continued to explain that his mission at the White House has never been, and never will be, to boost his own publicity. I'm not trying to build my own brand off the strength of the president. I'm here to serve the country. After The New Yorker published their story and immediately began to take some surprising and justifiable heat from the media. Scary Mus I tweeted, I sometimes use colorful language. I will refrain in this arena but not give up the passionate fight for Trump's agenda. Scary Mus I had more truth to share hours later, sending out a tweet that would also hold corrupt media responsible for blowing up another non story. I made a mistake in trusting in a reporter, he tweeted. It won't happen again. Anyone can agree that Scaramucci's decision to trust a writer from The New Yorker may not have been the best decision, but can you honestly fault a patriot for being passionate about his president? Scaramucci is here to get things done and sometimes a little fire is necessary to wake up Washington. If President Trump and his family can recognize what is truly necessary for this country to move forward, why does it continue to be so hard for the popular media to do the same? It's time we look at results and start to celebrate the people who bring us real change. Share this now if you stand with President Trump and his family. That's the news. Join us here every day. Be sure to subscribe and click the bell. See you next time. This is TBNN.